Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about what is Magic Digital Next. Uh, Magic Digital Next is the eSport version of Magic the Gathering. It has been pitched to investors as the next step or a modern step in Magic Online. Magic Online right now seems like it's from 1995. I'm sure that Wizards of the Coast understands this and I'm definitely sure Hasbro understands as well given that their CEO is from Microsoft. So he's probably like, oh wow, this program would be great in 1995. But Magic Digital Next has to be a better platform than Magic Duels and Magic Online. Because otherwise, why make a platform that's worse than those two? I feel Magic Digital Next will have a subscription-based model where you pay $10 a month and you have access to all the cards. And maybe you pay like $20 a month and you can draft as many times as you want. Uh, the technology already exists and the main reason people play Hearthstone is it's a cheaper and it's visually a more appealing. So those are two reasons. Magic Digital Next has to compete with Hearthstone. There's no ends, ifs, and buts. And I know Hasbro and Wizard of the Coast have said, oh, Hearthstone's not a direct competitor. Not on paper, but online they are. And it is one of the weird scenarios where there's a lot of smart people in Hasbro, including CEO of Hasbro, and he definitely knows. He definitely knows. I'm sure that he studied the Hearthstone model in great detail. He has teams studying the Hex model, Pokemon TCG, Card Fight Vanguard Beta. Like, there's card games, Yu-Gi-Oh!, which the, Konami doesn't even have an official version of it. These are just people who love the game and they developed it by themselves with no real funding. Magic Digital, and the same happens with uh, Magic Online. Um, Magic uh, x Maids. Uh, there's another one, I'm, uh, Cockatrice, I believe, is up. Again, I went down a little bit, uh, a little while ago. And this is how you can play Magic. And these are people who developed it without outside funding. They're not owned by Hasbro, they're not, by definition, they're not associated with Hasbro in any significant way. So Magic Digital Next has to be better than Magic Duels and it has to be better than Magic Online. Otherwise, they wouldn't make it. So what I'm proposing, or what I assume Magic Digital Next is, is it's a better UI. So the interface of Magic Duels is fine. It's not the greatest, but it's fine compared to Magic Online. Uh, so the interface is not the best, but it's good enough. And I hope they take that interface and that pricing model and just bring more cards from Magic Online onto it. And I don't really feel like copying Hearthstone is the worst case scenario. Hearthstone has proven a model that has worked. It works. So why not, you know, take some of the components and use them for your game? Um, copyright, IP stuff aside, they have a very successful model. Uh, mainly because I think the user experience is very good. It's streamable and most of most importantly, it's inexpensive to play or get started. Magic Online is too expensive. It's just too expensive for anyone to really, uh, for a casual player, which is most of your audience, to want to be part of. Too much money, right? Anyway, leave me a comment below what you think uh, Magic Digital Next will be and what what you hope it will be. Anyway, bye guys.